Hi, I'm Glyn, and uh, this is my day van that I got converted uh, into a day van by uh, Eco Wagon. I actually um, was a complete newbie, and I did some research on, on the, the internet. And it was what struck me about Eco Wagon was the actual reviews that other customers had left, and there wasn't a bad review on there. And, and that persuaded me to uh, give Kenny a ring and he was wonderful, absolutely wonderful. Lots of advice. The only thing I chose was the colour <laughs> of the lime, uh, but he, was, he advised me on everything else and it was absolutely amazing experience. Um, as you can see, uh, it's a day van, it hasn't got all the bells and whistles. In fact, uh, the conversion on this costs less than V80 on some of the other vans, <laughs> which is amazing. But it was what I needed because I've got a, I've got a caravan as well, we go away caravanning and uh, I didn't need a full-blown camper so you know you, it was really good to buy what I needed and had a lot of uh, input into, into the actual colours and, the, and how, how the van would be uh, laid out. I, I bought it because um, I'm a kayaker, I go kayaking a lot so it's ideal to put the, the kayak on top and head off to North Wales or Plangothlan or Matlock and um, have, have a day on the water and then not have to go home I can stay, stay over in the van, and then paddle the next day as well, which is brilliant. Because it's a day van, I've got huge amount of space because I haven't got all the cupboards and stuff in the way. Uh, this bed actually comes out to about there, so it's king size. I've had to buy everything king size: the sleeping bag, the duvets, everything has to be king size. It's a massive bed, which I usually share, have to share with my dog, uh, which is which, which is great. However, it does have um, a sink. And the, yeah, flip up tap, and the water's under here. There, the water's under there. It also has a grill. Yeah, and the gas is under here. So very well uh, designed. Out the way. Uh, I've also got a huge USB charger. Uh, I got this. This did, I was offered. We had a discussion with Kenny. I was offered a, a fridge in here. But it'd be very small. So, uh, but then he advised me. He's got one himself to get a Waco or Dometic uh, fridge, which is absolutely brilliant. Um, got cupboard space. Got pots and pans in here. We have a drawer there full of uh, rubbish. Don't want to see that. <laughs> Under here, uh, because uh, I had some input and he knew I was a caravaner, he's gone old style with it with this. And. It's like in a caravan, you can actually pull that down and I've got space under there, storage space under there, which can also be accessed from the back. Um, other features, I do have uh, a table here because it's, it's just tucked behind here, the table. It is also in lime green <laughs> and the stand's just, just tucked there. Uh, this is uh, a captain's seat that, because uh, there was a bench, uh, a bench seat there, three-person bench seat, which uh, Kenny Kenny did for me, and that swivels round just like in a in a proper camper, <laughs> which is excellent again. And at the back, lots of space under here. Got me barbecue, me chairs, lots and lots of space, me cable, and as you can see, that neatly rolls up. Onto that, we've got a bench bit there. What I really like is when it's dark and we're doing something at the back, I've got actually, he's put in some tail lights for me. And I had to go with the VW uh, embossed. <laughs>